good getting into that. It has been like a half an hour? Mm, more, more 45 like 40, minutes? 40 minutes, maybe. Okay. We have had a little to eat and we have more food in the oven. Yep. Indeed. Steam says this is running at one frame per second. I think Steam's lying. Give it a moment, it'll catch up. Sergeant Yumi okay. is looking for reliable people to help the guard. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all appreciate it. That's creepy. Hey, wanna, wanna be a guard? cubes no but but it's right over there over at chunks i hear they've got cubes anyway um our current quest has us taking the tram i'd rather keep doing other things in this zone first do we have a quest marker for finding the coffee Show all targets No, we do not have a quest marker for finding the coffee. We just need to find a coffee mm -hmm. somewhere. Anywhere. Oh, that's actually not a radiant quest or activity. Yeah, it's an actual quest. Actual quest, okay. But let's go back to the mainline plot. Mm-hmm. Again, I would really prefer to have. Yeah. Frame rate's not very good. No. Race. Yeah. I did check the recording. The recording appears to be fine. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's still, it's just as choppy as this, I should say. Just noticed. Yep, gravity is still a bit off. Oh, hold on a moment. I need to exit out of Power Toys. Forgot that I restarted my computer earlier. There we go. I want to make sure I can still bounce. Oh, this is an area that I didn't go to before. Or is it? Do not like this UI. Really tempted to install Sky UI or Star UI. Okay. Missions. Because I think what it is is that. No? Oh, I have it set to show all instead of just active. Okay. That makes more sense. Which means I need to go that way. Block the A. Okay. Hello, citizen. I don't speak French, unfortunately. It looked like French at a glance, but I think it might be... That might okay. be Portuguese, but... Kind of in the middle of something here. Yeah, I think that was still French. I know that I've spotted somebody speaking Lodgeban, which is a conline. Thanks. Oh yeah, I don't need my helmet right now. Mm-hmm. And don't you have, like, a set of civilian wear? Yes. But it's not on me, because everything's on the ship. Mm-hmm. Or I was able to just sell things directly. Here we are. The lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. I mean, there's fewer than they ten. They will be waiting mm -hmm. for us inside.
now it's unlocked for the rest of the game. Yep. Captain, everyone will be in the library, just inside. If yeah, Barry good. were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. I have expect Barry to already be here. You two keep going on like this, and I'm banning wages. I'm serious. We'll play nice. Just a little friendly conversation, Sarah. That's all. <laughs> now I'm going to do everything other than what I'm supposed to do. Mr. Armstrong, if you're nasty. And everything else is locked. Okay. Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Ah, uh, pirates attacked. Told me to deliver the artifact. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Oh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some yep. random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, <laughs> I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. They're here with the artifact. Thank you, Mateo. Now. Let's focus on what's in front of us. I mean, we would have come here eventually. What happened when it was Maybe. extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Ben, are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, Captain, if you expect us to believe in fairy tales, If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right, let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move That's when they're in close artifacts. contact. Okay. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have, the artifact, if you could place it on the table here. I suppose. That's oh. it. Just like the we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proof. Easy, girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Patrick? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting. Now, would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend here? Nance. <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. How much do you know about them? Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity Don't in mind the back in front of you. Of space. As to what they are, what they're building. Well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. Looks like we're still missing several pieces. Yep. You should take some time to get settled in. 
Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. Eight thousand. And we left it. Okay, let's not proceed here. Let's go find that coffee. Well, first, I'm going to check out that backpack. What is the difference? Well, it's better in almost but not quite every way. So, physical defense, energy defense, electromagnetic defense, resistance to thermal, resistance to corrosive, but no resistance to either airborne or radiation elements. Mm. It also weighs slightly more, but it's only slight. Also looks better. That's the more important part. I'll admit that the tunnel mining pack matches, but it looks better. Yeah. Orders. Orders. Ever since I got here, this has felt like home. These people are family. I hope it feels that way for you too. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for me right now. I guess a lot overwhelming now that I think about it. I'm Noelle. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. Hmm. How long have you been working on all of this? Well, Constellation's been around forever. More than 50 years now. But we That's only better. became aware of the artifacts recently. Barrett discovered the first one about two years ago, right under our noses. And he was the one who got this all in motion. It's a shame he isn't here to see this. I'm gonna have to go rescue him at some point, aren't I? Mm -hmm. The vision I saw, what do you think that was? Oh, right, that. If we're approaching this rationally, I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input. Your brain's attempt to make sense of something. An energy surge, some other phenomenon. The reason why I'm making a face is because our food is beeping right now. So we're going to pause this for a bit mm -hmm. while we eat second dinner. The other half of dinner, whatever you want to call it. Yep. And we'll be back. And we're back. Mm, fish. Yes, Barrett saw something too. Yeah. He did. At the time, well, it's Barrett. We weren't sure if he was kidding around. Clearly, he wasn't. Was it random synapses firing? It means something. Sure. I'm not trying to suggest otherwise. I wasn't there when it happened. I'm just thinking it through. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? I'm wondering about the other types of exploration work besides the artifacts? Mm -hmm. Of course. There's plenty of planets out there that no one has ever set foot on, and everything we learn about them is valuable. We have a board where we post anything specific we're looking for. A type of alien flora or fauna, or a planet with a specific quality, like if it's primed to have life but it doesn't yet. Nice. Radiant quests. Yep. I seem to know a lot about these artifacts. Oh gosh, no. I mean that's that's flattering, but really we're making this up as we go. Until you arrived, we only had the two, and the vaguest sense that there was something more at work. There's still so much we don't know. And that means a lot of work ahead of us. Well, Sarah so said something about a place for me to stay. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Right. So you've seen the library. Obviously. I do need my shoulder. Walter's 
quite proud of the collection, but Mateo has made more than a few contributions. Constellation living up to your expectations. I'm glad to hear a moment of quiet comfort. You could have done just about anything on the quiet part, so it is important to me that you feel valued. Seriously? Leave these people. No. We're out of here. I don't have a choice. It was a big to-do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten we're here. Like, they couldn't have you are satisfied with made it so people don't talk over you. each other, and that shouldn't be hard to program. It wasn't even that. They were trying to talk to somebody who was actively talking to us. Yeah. That shouldn't have been hard no, to No, that should not have happened. And that is very unpleasant for most neurodivergent people. Well, most neurodivergent people in that regard. I am neurodivergent, and that does not bother me anywhere near as much as it does you. Like, I couldn't get any of that because it was all just a cacophony. I couldn't when you started having problems with it because you added a third layer of cacophony to it. Mm -hmm. So this is the bar. Usually no tender, so help yourself. Within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. You're in luck. We were almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. It's been nice having the place so full. Pixelated art. I like the books, even if they're very obviously fake. Oh, such wide hallways. Okay, this will be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet, and Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so I'd better get back to it. Don't want to keep her waiting too long. Enjoy! Fancy room. Exotic bottle, chair, lamps, and tablet. Tablet. Moby Dick. I get the feeling of Oblivion with Bloom set on. <laughs> Everything is glowing way too much right now. Chronomark watch case. Oops, I meant to open that. I do have my own storage. Mm. That's nice. Does it have a limit for how much you can stuff in it? Doesn't look like it. Nope. Let's try putting some lead in there. Mm. Nope. Unlimited. Well, now I know where I'm storing things, at least for the time being. A Chardonnay. They're so fancy. I know nothing about actual alcohol stuff. This is apparently Mateo's room. Pillows on the floor. Incense. Ah, we have a pharmaceutical lab over here. And a bed in the same room. Is it someone's room? Deep. Did we forget to turn off the oven? No? Oh, okay. Just open it. There we go. Forgot that it was even running. My, our dishwasher is super quiet. Ah, uh, the standard if you're not a part of the solution, you're part of precipitate. And make sure, yep, you are in camera. I'll take that. I'm actually use some things. Desktop fishbowl. 
But I take it one of the people here is a chemist. One of them obviously plays bat ball. That looks like a combination of cricket and baseball. But Chunk sponsors it. Nice touch. Old Earth Baseball. I'm sorry, is that a Pip-Boy? Hmm? Is that a mm, Pip-Boy? Not quite. More of a tablet. Toy Spaceship. Instant oatmeal without clusters. Ooh. Somebody's old living area? That poor plant is indoors. Obviously, obviously storage for somebody. Mm -hmm. Unlock inaccessible. So I need higher luck picking skill, presumably. Either that or it's a quest reward. Yep. More of those dex desk can't speak. Desk assistance. Another weapon case that's inaccessible. I'll take lock pick, thanks. And another incense burner. They certainly like their incense around here, don't they? I mean, it's better than Fallout 4 and the Outer Worlds' obsession with everything, everybody smoking. Yeah. Ready room with a display projector that I could take for some weird reason. Yeah, the thing about smoking in Fallout 4 is that they have spots where you have NPC idle animations smoking here. Mm -hmm. I have seen since the robotic versions smoking. Uh, okay. They're learning to fit in with the other humans, I guess? Mm-hmm. Like, I can understand that Nick Valentine smokes because it's habit. Following is an excerpt from a 2283 SSNN news report about constellations near collapse. And although Constellation's relevance remains a subject of debate among New, New Atlantis intelligentsia, the disappearance of its founder, Sebastian Banks, was a blow most felt the organization couldn't survive. In fact, Constellation's disbanding seemed imminent until member Chloe Bao changed her vote in the 11th hour, thus ensuring the group's continued operation, at least for the time being, as well as her unexpected appointment to the position of chair. Okay. It looks like the original founder... Became lost? Interesting. Ooh, I like the globe. Earth globe. Hmm. I can't spin it. Bother your wife? That is a rather personal question, but I'll indulge it. I'm told that when I'm not here, I'm distracted by what I might be missing and wind up crabby or a favorite irascible. It has been determined that for the long term health of our relationship, that I am better off here rather than simply making things worse at home. Wow. All right. Whatever works for the two of you, I guess. Yeah, it's yeah. Good, good that they figure it out. Mm -hmm. I mean, I need time apart once in a while. Mm -hmm. I'm not particularly the type of person who does, but I certainly understand the feeling. And that's why our relationship I works. Your service, okay. Captain. Captain, now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. No additional protocols necessary. Also, 
given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, yes, please. it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. We didn't start a timer. No, we didn't. Um, we are at 25 minutes. Could you start a timer for a half an hour, potentially? Okay. Do you miss Barrett? My primary function has been to support and protect Barrett during his travels. I am currently unable to do so. That is as capable as I can be of missing anyone. I believe Barrett would find your question amusing. Protecting Barrett must have been quite the challenge. Barrett has thus far survived every mission on which we have embarked. It is therefore evident that my efforts have been successful. I suspect that Barrett would disagree with how necessary my intervention has been in any given situation. The exploration of an unknown planet can be a major undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, and defenses. It is even possible to set up multiple outposts capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. How do I know if a planet has the resources I need? A planetary scan yeah. will reveal the presence of key inorganic resources. Although, rarer elements will be harder to find without training, and while a scan may detect the presence of life on the planet, you will have to analyze the native plants and animals yourself to know what That's compounds what they here. produce. What kind of advanced structures could I build? The scan booster is the most obvious, as it will enable you to detect landmarks and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while fabricators enable the manufacturing. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links allowing you to share resources between other outposts you have built. So this sounds a lot like the... Provisioner system that yeah. I'm involved for, yeah. The blueprints you need to construct an outpost should already be on your watch. It will automatically connect to any available materials for construction in your ship's cargo. Well, at least the cargo is useful for something. How long have you been part of Constellation? I arrived along with many material goods purchased by the group's previous chair, Malcolm Livingstone. Despite several significant system replacements and upgrades, I have been online for 43 years. Nice. Yeah. I don't know if I want you on my crew right now. Well, we're not an introvert, so we probably do. Well, I suppose calling you a rock breaker may have been a bit out of line. Well, that's one of the things with you. You don't even know me! I think I'll work. Still doesn't excuse it. My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans have jeopardized one of our ventures. It's not fair for me to take it out on you, especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. So, let's start over, shall we? Walter Stroud, CEO of Stroud Eklund, member of Constellation, and off times grumpy old man. Welcome aboard. Hope the drinks are at least free. Yes, well, a stop bar is a treat I think Constellation can afford. For now. But if you clean us out, you're on your own. By the way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit customization, pharmaceutical manufacturing, testing alien substances, the whole thing. You can even fashion industrial pieces for large-scale projects, if you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby planet, that is. I'm a fan of self-reliance, so I encourage you to make use of the tools we have to build what you need. 
Hmm. What kind of company is Ground Elkind? The most well known for ship manufacture. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it, you choose Stroud Eklund. Unfortunately, our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covet them. The bastards. I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help in that regard, but they're married to Deimos Star Yards, and those old salts are stuck in the glory days. Isn't where I would expect to find the CEO. Funny thing about companies, you build one sturdy enough, it doesn't need you there all the time to prop it up. Stroud Eklund functions quite well on a day to day basis, leaving me time to devote to more esoteric pursuits. For years, I was captivated by the writings of Constellation's founder, Sebastian Banks. I finally decided to do something more than admire from a distance, and so now, I call the Lodge home, as much as anywhere else. What's your role in Constellation? Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. <laughs> has to fund the I wallet, mean... And all my success in business doesn't mean much if I can't put it to good use. I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan. Or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make sure that they have the resources they need. And as you've now seen, those resources aren't being wasted. We're onto something big here. You think the vision I had means anything? Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed it as, I don't know, hallucinations. But now, I'm not sure what to think. I don't suppose you have a history of this sort of thing, do you? Never seen anything like that in my life. Oh, sure, I see lights and hear music all the time. It's a non-stop party in my head. I've hit my head recently, if that's what you're asking. I mean, have I seen something like this before? I'm not going with the sarcasm. Not exactly, no. But I suppose it doesn't matter. You saw something. Barrett saw something. That's an unlikely coincidence. Yep. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Baron and Young Noel there. But I think we can all agree there's something unusual going on mm -hmm. here. Frankly, this is the most exciting thing that's happened in years. Okay. Until next time. Oh, my flashlight's still on. Mm-hmm. Right in his face. Yep don't mind the violin sitting here ask if you've got questions speak up if you have ideas we're all here for the same reason are you doing okay i'm not sure anyone really asked yet don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else you matter too you've done something really significant bringing that artifact here i'm mateo theological scholar by trade but now well an explorer like you. It's really good to have you with us. What do you make of the vision that I saw? I'm not gonna lie. I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but you know, if the label fits. If it meant something, I don't understand it. Or I didn't understand it. Yeah. Okay. That's alright. Maybe you weren't supposed to. Maybe it'll make sense later. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. We just need more data, which means more artifacts. What brought you to Constellation? Well, there was some overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. I'd made a really incredible discovery, only to lose it to a greedy corporation. So I tried to steal it back. In the process, I met Walter. Turned out he owned the corporation. After a long talk, we realized we had a lot in common, and I was invited to join Constellation. 
So these artifacts all came out of caves? Second one was on Kazaa. Buried the same as the one you found. But the first one, right under our noses for years, sitting in storage, masquerading as an oversized paperweight. Can you imagine potentially the greatest discovery in human history collecting dust? Yeah, that sounds about right. Uh, why didn't you think the artifacts are such a big deal? Take care of yourself. Because it's the first sign of intelligence outside of. Sarah is the best uh, possible yeah, person I guess. to run a constellation at a time like this. Focus, Focus. no nonsense, and dedicated. Oh, I'm not talking to Sarah. Out there, it makes it back to us. I know he gets into trouble all the time, and everyone just sort of accepts yes. he'll be fine. But still, yeah. He's the type of person who is always fine until he isn't. Yep. So many activities. Um... I mean, the quest marker is not going to do me any good. What about crafting or modifying that? Do we actually have quest markers for that? I do. They're over there? Oh, there's another floor. Oh no, this is just the exterior exit. Exterior exit? As opposed to interior exits? Ooh. Rooftop garden? Yeah. Nice. Did, did I hear something scutter? See? Is it your dream home? And there was something about seeing someone about yeah. your mortgage? Dream home. Nessoy. Yep, one small step is now complete. So we do need to do that probably mm -hmm. quickly, given that that, even though it probably isn't timed, it sounds timed. Mm -hmm. And then visiting my home. Anyway. Mm-hmm. Far less fog. At least I have the key. Otherwise, that would have been awkward. Ah, so the door is automatically locked. That's probably a good idea. Mm-hmm. Basement. Ah, all the rest of the crafting benches. Weapons workbench. Looks like it's grabbing things from my ship's inventory. Or maybe it's using uh... local stuff. Yeah, maybe um, Constellation has good okay. stuff, because I'm seeing materials here that I don't think you have. Let's go ahead and put a compensator, which increases stability, cost of long-range accuracy. Can you modify oh, yeah, the mining yeah, laser? Yeah, it just dawned on me as I was backing out. A skin. There. It's modified. That was not a particularly useful modification. No. Uh, spacesuit workbench. Ah. These can have them, too. Extra carrying capacity is available on booster packs. That's good to know. Mm -hmm. Not that I have any polymers. Increasing resistance. And extra oxygen. Looks like I can have two mods on at least this one. Mm -hmm. Also, I could increase do different boost packs. Looks like it's more power. Okay. 
I'm assuming at some point that's going to matter. Oh, four mod slots on the actual spacesuit. Ballistic shielding, EM shielding, and energy shielding. Uh, the helmet. Same. Given that there's four slots and I only have three options, I'm assuming we get to learn more with research. Mm -hmm. The tunnel mining pack. Extra capacity. Oh, it's the same because it's the other pack that I have. Okay. But it had one fewer slot. Yes. Industrial workbench. Allows you to create basic manufactured components, which can be used for building structures for your outposts and crafting mods for your weapons and equipment. Raw resources can be acquired from planets and moons by starting up resource extractors. More advanced stuff can be created from fabricators. Ah. So this is where we build the things that we need for our outposts. And for other things. Probably ship mods for some of this would be my guess. We can build them, but I have no idea what they're useful for, so I'm not going to for right now. Ah, tools. That actually sounds like the type of thing that should be here. The mission work. I'll continue investigating other things first. Farm lab, cooking station. Okay. Locate Coraline Landmast in Guinebu. Guinebu? Guinebu. Guinebu. Locate a gaseous font in Kumasi. Locate pelted fields in Alpha and Astre. Locate a primordial network in Vega. And survey a planet in the Karine system. Okay. Mm -hmm. These are exploration tasks. I'm not going to grab one at the moment. I'm going to finish looking and see what's in the basement. I wonder if they have um, implemented something like um, um, fire or low reward based on how long you take to complete the mission. I don't know. Probably not, but it would be realistic. It'd be realistic, but not necessarily more fun. Exactly. But like, you told Donna that you would get her a coffee and... Mm -hmm. And like Master Lock. Three days later, you give her the coffee and she's no longer in the mood. <laughs> yeah. So there is a spacesuit that's behind a Master Lock. So now we know that other lock is something that's plot locked. Plot locked. Yeah. Since it actually does tell you the difficulty. Ah, the well. We have a task to investigate that. Ah, the well's the sewers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't feel like doing that right now. But it's good to know that we can enter from there. And given that this is friendly home base area, that's probably a good place to enter from. Did we finish achieving that activity? Looks like it. Our parents are in Pioneer Tower. That's here, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, no, it's not. So that is selected. Oh, yep. That's here in New Atlantis. Okay. So we should also talk to our parents. Uh, which planet is our dream house on? A uh, very different planet. Right. I got it's a different planet, and it's probably a different star system as well. Yes. But where is it? Oh. We should look. But first, I want to make sure it doesn't get repoed. Yes. Because that would be bad. Switch 
back to green home first. It's in on Nessoi, but we don't know what system that is in at the moment. Might, this it, might as well toggle on the quest markers for the collecting the biosensors in case I any... can't toggle on more than one at a time. You can't? It's one or all. So you'll notice right now that this is selected. Mm -hmm. I can select a mission. So if I select the old neighborhood, Dream Home gets unselected. And for an activity, I only get one. I can do show all targets. And that should show all activities. Or I can... No, it actually just shows everything. And that's just really confusing. Yeah, but you have one that's... Oh no, that's probably talking to Sarah. The yeah. One that's... Yep. Close by. Oh, locating the biosensors. That is that way, a decent distance. That took me to the um, train station before. Did I just finish that quest? Since that's almost done. Mm. How am I on top of? Yeah, I I don't think you're supposed to be on top of this. Probably not. But it was built in an accessible There's way. There's the bank. Mm. Let's say let's see if they have banker hours or if they're a yep. bit more accessible. Well, given that there's different hours for everything, it feels like. Who are you? Cleaning bot? Cleaning bot. Okay. Alright. You are a citizen. Gotta run soon. I'm late to a meeting. You're late to a meeting at this time of night. Okay. I really like how this place is laid out. I mean, it's not intuitive for me right now or anything. I'm talking about the fact that everything's pedestrian accessible. Mm -hmm. There are no cars. And it's a giant park. Citizen? Citizen. Excuse me. Apologies. People cleaning and falling into the terrain because they were on top of the... It smells real good here. Just look at it. It took years to get it looking just like this. I thought they were digging. Whatever you say. I know you think this is a joke of a job. But keeping the grounds immaculate, you can take pride in it. Nobody cares. Nobody's looking at it. I'm looking at it. These greens are the heart of the commercial district. And if it's clean, if it is thriving, so is New Atlanta. I'm just, just here for the paycheck. <laughs> You'll come around. You'll see. Yeah, that's that's one thing I really loved about the um, religion in Morrowind is that mm -hmm. pride is actually one of the virtues. Like you should do work that you're proud of, and you should mm -hmm. be proud of the work you do. Don't be nervous. You got this. Change right, your appearance. Isn't it going to confuse him? You won't even recognize you. I'd be mysterious. Mm. Well, that's so one way of breaking up with your ex. Maybe for our third day, I'll be a redhead. <laughs> I feel underdressed. 
Yeah. I don't know why they set up shop here. They'd be better off in the yard, but Outlands uses people like that. Listen, I love them plate right now. You don't look like a new hire stumbling through their first day. Who exactly are you? <laughs> the two of us have arms are now stand and read the memo. What? Oh, you. You really look like you know how to use that thing. I have an eye for town, and I have a feeling about you. We're just here to play the mortgage. Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> Kidding, really. I have a business proposition uh -oh. for you that could uh, help us both out. Why do I get mad feelings about this? Is it legal? You're a law and order type. Oh, well, this is perfect. This job is literally serving mm, But I'm working for a corporation. You help me, you help all of us. We are not doing debt collection. You're putting me up pretty thick. <laughs> so you see right through me. That's not hard. You are just the person I'm looking for. This sounds like a confession time. I might just be a little desperate. See, the world credit analysis, you know, dealing with deadbeats and reprobates is, uh, it's a tough field. What I need is a ring. Someone that can collect yep, some that of collection. the top delinquent uh -huh. offenders. What I need is you. You work with me, and the fee you get will be huge. It's a typical black debt collection. If you haven't noticed, and I'm guessing you have, the settled systems is big. Like, like really big. <laughs> Someone gets seriously underwater, they skip the system. And it's a real pain to track them down. Sad truth is, we can't track everyone down, so credit analysis always has a black eye on reporting to the higher ups. Now listen, I, I love them. You don't look like a new. Really? Hmm. Oh, this is. I have a thing. Um. Listen, I. I'm trying to see if I can talk to them about my mortgage. mortgage. Constellation. As in the. Oh wow! I used to read story. Oh, this is. Nope. Uh huh. I have to accept the quest first. And we we can't even say we're not interested. Good. Well, yeah, confession time. I might just it's accept it. Right mm -hmm. What I need is a ring. What I need is. Tell me about the mortgage. Oh, I can tell you're eager. That's good. No, we don't want to do this. Yes. <laughs> so we got a galaxy class con man took out a loan to franchise a restaurant. Turns out, surprise, it was a scam. And dear Maliki jumps system. He's holed up in a literal shack in the middle of nowhere. Can you believe it? <laughs> uh, the job is simple. Get Dieter to pay. And we don't want him dead. We don't want him hurt. Just close his account like an honest citizen. Uh, is it dangerous? Well, I mean, yes. But we're not the only ones looking for him. And you don't dome yeah, up on a dust bowl unless you're serious about dodging your civic responsibility. Yeah, I suppose going to another planet would be serious. I'll send over all the details. You find Dieter, and I hate to end on this note, but you know, not everyone is straight arrow. If you cut a deal with Dieter, honestly, I have no way of knowing. But don't expect any more jobs from me. Best of luck. I believe in you. Can we look out there? I mean it. Yes. Right. Small home in the Olympus system. So right? it's in the Olympus system. There's a balance on that property. Argos extractors negotiated a very fine loan for you. There are weekly payments, but if you miss a payment, no big deal. It's a pay as you go type of affair. But I think we'd all be happier if you dealt with the mortgage one way or the other. So if I miss a payment, it's... Okay. I mean, you won't be let into your house without paying. But no day in your record if you let the property mm. sit. Honestly, it's almost like a locked-in rental. Pretty standard for some mining outfits. 
tell me my options. Certainly. So there are two ways to take care of a loan for good. One's easy, just pay off the balance, then the house is yours, free and clear, and you are one very happy new homeowner. The other option, less ideal, is just walk away and we foreclose on the property. So it's 125,000 total. Okay. Absolutely. Take off the time. And we have hit an hour. All Gulf Bank transactions are secure and guaranteed. I like people watching. Mostly watching them be miserable. Hey. Hey yourself? Yeah, yeah good, good talk. talk. Mm -hmm. Anything I can do for you? Yeah. yeah. Find a gal bank teller and, and deposit all your cards into my bank account. account. It'll be paid, paid, of course. course. Eventually. <laughs> what are you doing here? Time to get a job at gal bank. It's the big building with the word gal bank on it. You're funny. I like it. I'm sorry, sorry you feel that, that way. way. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'd like to be a banker. It'll be fun. Why do you want to work here? Because magic, magic isn't real, which means I can't be a necromancer. Mm. I think being a soul-sucking banker was the next best thing. Fair enough. I like her. She's like she's an entire character. Why? <laughs> <laughs> because I hate myself. Huh. Guess we have that in common. All right. I like to paint. I like to crochet. Pretty much hate everything else. You're starting to grow me, though. Like a fungus. But I like mushrooms. Guess that's the third thing. You really like her. Uh-huh. Well, um, we've basically hit another hour. Oh, here's the... ATM. Which we can steal from if we had the correct skill. Yeah, but let's end the video and then just immediately record another because okay. I want to go visit our parents. Yeah, next time we visit the parents. Hope you've enjoyed this internet and talk to you next time. Bye. Bye.